Hello, welcome to the future of AI. In this video, I'm excited to introduce you to an incredible website called Fidgetal Plus. It's a versatile text-to-image generator that combines the best AI tools all in one place. With Fidgetal Plus, you can create stunning images using cutting-edge technologies like Midjourney, Dolly 2, Lexica, Stable Diffusion, and more. What makes this website truly exceptional is that it brings together a variety of image-generating features in a single platform. You can not only create images but also edit them, perform face swaps, rotate images at 360 degrees, add captivating morph video effects, and much more. Let me show you how this website works. Watch this video till the end and let me know your thoughts. So first of all, you go to this website called Fidgetal Plus. I will mention the link in the description. You simply have to sign up or log in with your Google account. So I have an account, so I will log in. So after signing up, you will see this interface. It looks like a canvas. It's basically a canvas where you can play with your images by connecting one image to another and applying a variety of effects. In this video, I'll show you how it works. So if you see on the right side, you will see a variety of AI models like Mid Journey, Stable Diffusion, Excel, Stable Diffusion 1.5, Dell E2. Also, you can transform your generated images into Stable Diffusion. You can also in-paint your images, which means you can select a specific area within your image and add new objects to that chosen area. You can also upscale your images, you can add 3D effects, you can rotate your images and there are a lot of options. I'll show you how this website works. So first of all, we will generate the image by using these models that are given over here. I will select mid journey because this is one of my favorites. So a prompt box will appear in front of you where you have to write your prompt, your negative prompts, do your settings and then you can generate your images. Now if you see below you can find an option of chat gpt so by using chat gpt you can generate your prompts you can also switch to chat gpt 3 or chat gpt 4 and you can generate your prompts using chat gpt so i already have a prompt i will simply paste it over here so basically i want a beautiful attractive woman a straight full body image also i'm adding that it should be a 3d image with dark background and also i'm adding the color of the dress that i want a black dress so after writing all the details i will write negative prompts that i don't want an ugly image disoriented mutated image so add the negative prompt so it does not generate the images that you don't want so there are also some additional settings that you can use. Here you can see an option of seed. It is basically used to create and generate consistent images. So you can generate consistent faces using same seed value. But if you increase or decrease the seed value, you can generate a different image. Then I will set the aspect ratio to 3 by 4. And once all of my settings are done, I will click on start. So here is the result let me show you okay so the image look absolutely stunning and uh, i'm in love with all of the images all of them look really beautiful just look at the result and look at the quality and detail of the images simply in love now right click on the canvas there you will see some options click on the last option transform images there you will see an option of control net exit click on that now as i want to edit my third image i will connect this third node with the node of start image in this way both of they will be connected to each other and i will be able to edit my third image now i will copy paste the same prompt just instead of black dress i will write red dress because i want to convert my black dress into red dress then i will add the same negative prompts then i will click on start so here is the result and you can see my third image with black dress is now converted into red dress so let me show you so it looks absolutely stunning and you can see how beautifully it has converted my black dress into the red dress now i will click on upscale to increase the resolution of my image you can see how beautifully this website is designed in a node based ai you can connect the nodes and create different images using different ai models so i'm really enjoying creating images on this website so my image is upscaled and you can see how beautiful it looks let me download it and show you the results so look at the image it looks absolutely stunning i'm simply in love with the result 
now let's try something else i will clear my canvas and from the model section i will select stable diffusion excel and here i will write my prompt so now i want an ai robot in space 3d full body image so after writing my prompt i will write some negative prompts as well now i will choose a style as i want a 3d image i will select 3d model then in the styles i will select dream shaper then i will do additional settings and after done i will click on start so here is the result let me show you so the image looks absolutely stunning all of the images are really good and uh, i'm simply in love so now i want to rotate my images i will right click on the canvas go to transform images and click on the rotate object 360 degree so now i want to rotate the second image so i will simply connect the node of second image to the node of rotate image then in the settings, I will set the horizontal angle to 180 degree, set the number of images to 2, once done, I will click on start. So here is the result, my image is rotated to 180 degree. Now in the next step, I will simply upscale this image. Now my image has been upscaled. Now in the next step, I want to add colors to this black image. So for doing that, I will go to transform images and click on control net excel. So now a new prompt box will pop up in front of me. So what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna add the same prompt over here. Just I will add some one or two extra words saying that the image is showing the backside view. So add colors to it, etc. So you can add your prompts according to whatever you like or whatever kind of image you want to generate. So I will add the negative prompts as well. Then in the style, I will select Dream Shaper. You can select whatever you want. Now I will connect the node of my image to this node of control net excel. So once the nodes are connected, I will click on start. So my images are ready and you can see it has added colors, background and everything to the image and it looks absolutely stunning. You can see the image is in 180 degree and uh, it has beautifully created my image. I'm simply in love with how this website works in a sequence by connecting nodes. I'm really loving it so i will clear my canvas and let's try something else now i will tell you how you can turn your images into paintings and realistic portraits so if you scroll down you will see an option of import files just simply click on that now i will add an image over here that i want to turn into a painting and realistic portrait so i will simply upload an image after uploading just simply click on stable diffusion 1.5 so you have to connect the node of the image to stable diffusion 1.5 then i will simply write my prompt so in the prompt i will write that i want a digital painting realistic digital painting in hd resolution so once done i will write negative prompts then i will select the style of the image you can select whatever you want then click on start so here is the result of the image i will simply upscale the image that i like so i will click on upscale so here is the result of the image after downloading and you can see how beautifully it has converted my image into a digital painting simply in love now let me show you how you can convert your image in a realistic portrait so simply open stable diffusion 1.5 and write in the prompt that you want a realistic digital portrait so i will write my prompt properly then i will add negative prompts and then i will select the style of the image then i will simply connect my image to the node of the stable diffusion 1.5 so here is the result Let so me you show can see you. how beautifully it has converted my image into a realistic portrait and uh, the images are really beautiful i will simply download it and let me show you the result after upscaling the image so i will simply upscale the image that i like the most and after that i will show you the final result so just check out this image it looks absolutely stunning really i'm simply in love and um, i can't explain how beautifully it has converted the real image into a portrait kind of image so as you can see this was the image before and this one is after which is converted into the realistic portraits and it looks really good 
Now let me tell you about an amazing tool. If you click on the image, you will see an option of in paint. Just simply click on that. Now using this image, you can brush the part of the area that you want to change. Now for example, I want a hat in this image. So I will brush the area that I want to change. After brushing the area, I will simply click on mask plus ST. So a new prompt box will appear in front of me. So in this prompt box, I will simply write a red hat. Then I will select the style and click on start. So here is the result and uh, you can see how beautifully it has added a red hat to my image. This was the original image and this is the image after adding the hat. Simply in love how gracefully or beautifully it has added a hat. The image looks so real. No one can say that this image is edited. So simply in love just look at the quality of the image. So this website has a variety of other tools as well. I would recommend you to give it a try because I'm simply in love with this website. So if you see its pricing plan, their advanced plan starts in $10 per month and it gives you 1000 generations. And I think it is very, very reasonable. You should give it a try. Also, their premium plan starts for $22 per month and i think this is very reasonable and you can see i'm already using their plus plan because i really love this website i would recommend you to give this website a try and explore their website because it's really amazing now i have a good news for you you can get 20 percent discount on all the pricing plans just simply click on get premium and select your desired plan for example i will select this one month advanced plan which starts from 15 dollar per month now for an additional discount on this $15 per month, click on add promotion code and type future over here for an additional 20% discount. Click on apply and here the promo code is applied and you can see I have got 20% discount on this pricing plan and I just have to pay $12 per month which is very reasonable. Now enter your card details and click on subscribe to subscribe your desired plan. So that's all. Please do like and subscribe to support me so I can make more future AI videos for you guys. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.